<clears throat> hey everyone, Eric here from True Body Fitness. Just wanted to do, uh, send you guys out this quick message here. Very, 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 very important to uh, to me, and it's something that I kind of uh, li live by uh, in terms of the way I do things in my life, and the way I dream, and the way I, uh, you know, create success in my life, and the way I want things to happen in my life. You know, we dream often enough, and we tend to think dreams are not realities, that they're just fake, and I can 100% tell you right now that that's not true. I mean, as long as you keep doing something each and every day, that's going to get you closer to your goal. It's going to help support your goal and your dream. I mean, it's it's 100% possible, but when you make a dream or, you know, you have a goal in, in mind and uh, you, you know, you don't work at it, you're not persistent at it, I mean, the, the thoughts of getting there become diminishing because you haven't been working on it. You haven't get, been getting any closer. Uh, it's like working out. I mean, if, if you plan on gaining muscle but not working out and just eating healthy, I mean, for the most part, you can't really, I mean, gain the muscle tissue that you want. It's just not feasible. So you just really, 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 really got to set your mind to it. Keep consistent, persistent, and don't let anyone tell you you can't do something. Um, what you're going to hear uh, just right now is a, a line from Les Brown. He uh, tells a little story about a little boy, and uh, I'll leave it at that, and I'll kind of let you uh, listen to it and kind of see uh, how, you know, how it all plays out and you know, it's how true that the mind is, is, is only limited to what, what it's been told and what it's been adhered to. So I want you guys to really take that in, 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 uh, in depth. And I want you guys to really, 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 really focus on what you want and tell yourself that you can do it. And don't let anyone else tell you different. Uh, you know, much like the, uh, the pursuit of happiness where, uh, you know, Will tells his son that, you know, don't let anyone tell you you can't do something. If you want something, go get it, period. That's exactly what it's like. You know what? If you want something, go get it. Uh, no one's stopping you other than, you know, the people that are just haters and, you know, are toxic in your life and you want to get rid of those people. So, I mean, all in all, dream big, bigger than big, and bigger than most. And you'll be quite surprised on what you can do. Thanks, guys. Have a good one. A little boy, two little guys were out playing on some ice. And that was supposed to have been solid. And one of the little boys stepped on a thin air of the ice and fell in a hole. And as he began to start thrashing in the water, he began to move with the undercurrent to other areas of the ice. And his friend was there trying to help him beat and hitting the ice, trying to save his friend. And he panicked and he, he looked just a short distance away and there was a tree and he went and he ripped a branch off and he came back trying to get his buddy out and he just took the best he could to start scraping around the ice to make a circle and when he did he started beating on it and beating on it and there all of a sudden the ice began to crumble and he was able to pull his friend out to safety when the paramedics finally got there they saw what had happened how thick the ice was he saved the little boy's life but what baffled him they looked at the branch, and they looked at this little scrawny guy and said, how did he do this? It's impossible. They just went beating around the ice to see how thick it was, hearing the thumping sound. Said, how did he do that? I mean, it was a miracle that he was able to just take that branch and go around, make a circle, and beat the ice and pull him through. He's just too small. It's just impossible. And an old man standing around, hearing the conversation, stepped forward and said, I can tell you how he did it. He didn't have anybody here to tell him he couldn't do it.